bus ride to get here. First time on a Malaysian train. Eat some food, go to hungry? the toilet. Yeah. I need I really need to go to the toilet. <laughs> you need to eat food? <laughs> yeah, a little bit for on the way. Yeah. A little walk away from the Lumut jetty is um, a bus terminal where you can catch buses to um, central KL uh, and also other locations around the country. There's a little place, a little eatery where you can just grab some food and um, the buses are all stationed behind me so my bus leaves at 2.30 Um sir, what is my bus number? What is, do you know the bus number? Tuntati bus coming But no bus number? No bus number Oh, okay I'm not going to have any problem getting on Just wait, get 11 11, alright Three and, a, three and a half or four hour bus ride uh, down to KL Central and from there I need to take a train uh, to the location where my hostel is going to be. Um, but, you know, excited for more adventure this evening in KL for the first time. I can't believe I'm finally getting there. Woo! You know, I've constantly had new friends around me and I've not actually hardly had a moment. Um, to feel lonely or to feel alone or uh, or anything. So um, I'm on the bus now headed to KL Central and I'm so glad that I came early to the bus because the bus literally pulled away like seven minutes early. So we're heading out of the moot school. We're pulling away from the bus station now. Um, but yeah goes to show, always come early to your bus because your driver might be eager to leave soon. My first time in K KL and now I'm looking for um, Little India to figure out where it is. I have no idea if I'm going in the right direction or not. I'm just in a really busy mall right now. There's lots of air conditioning in here. And Costa Coffee, Victoria's Secret, lots of familiar brands. Excuse me? Do you know which direction Little Little India is? Uh, two floors down from here. Two floors down? I think we're outside from the Okay, <laughs> thank you. So I was told by the other guys I needed to go up, but this lady said I need to go down too. So I'm going to go down this escalator ahead and. Um, I've got Dorothy Perkins, my goodness, this is, feels like so British. It's really cool because I've never ever been to this city before. And this is, it seems like a really, really big city. Now to find, now I have to find Little India and Brickfields without walking accidentally in front of a car or traffic because I'm busy looking at... Oh, I see something that 
that way. Something to spice. Thank you. You're looking very nice, huh? Oh, thank you. <laughs> I just arrived too far away. Mm. That's good. Okay, can I have that? How many? Two. Three. <laughs> of India like it reminds me of the smells of when I was walking in Chadley Chow Market in Delhi it's really cool so much like Indian fashion right behind me Indian restaurants now time to find some food Getting really distracted with Indian clothing. I love Indian fashion. Just so much to look at. They've got roti kinchana. where my hostel is so I'm going to track that down now and so I'm going to use the train system here for the first time because I know it's straight up ahead so we are here right now and I need to go here Pasar Sani first time ever using the subway here or the train so basically I have to I have to scan with that and it was like 1.30 to take one stop Excuse me, let's go to Penn South Sydney Is that me? Yeah, yeah, thank you First time on a Malaysian train I'm so tired, I went to a shop bought a couple of Indian um, like similar to Punjabi suits
Ling Street. Now I'm just going to re rely on my Google Maps to help me find a uh, hostel that I'm going to called Augusto and hope that that will get me to <laughs> the place, my destination. Wow, that's pretty cool. Check out that building. So, so, so excited to have a shower and just crash and go to sleep. I am shattered, absolutely shattered. Oh.